Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Carla and on this channel I share videos on fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. If you enjoy these kinds of videos, then please subscribe down below. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my Telfar handbag collection. And the reason why I wanted to share this with you is sometimes there are people who know they want a Telfar handbag, but there are certain colors that you question, okay, I'm going on this site, but what's the true color of this handbag? Or not even true, but something, is this the real color that I'm going to get from the website? Am I going to get a color like this in person? So I want to share with you guys a couple of them. If this is what you're thinking about getting the first ones i'm going to start off with are my smaller ones so this one let me kind of just get you guys to a true to color and for the remainder of this video i'm probably like the color of this video is going to look weird because i want to get you guys as true of a color handbag as possible so this is the orange handbag i know a lot of people don't like these handbags because the straps do not like they're not removable like it's attached and it is what it is i usually just tuck it in like this and i actually walk around with my bag open as well some people do close it and that's the look you get i prefer this look right here so this is how i wear it so this is the orange telfar handbag and then this is the brown one these two you actually saw um as the my thumbnail so this is how the brown looks for the most part it's kind of like a very chocolatey brown so for my brown skin girls my brown skin boys um this handbag is beautiful like it looks so beautiful against our skin especially if we're wearing all brown all brown is <laughs> that's probably my favorite monochromatic outfit like all brown creams yes but all brown so this is the color that you get. This is pretty true to color. The next um, small Telfar handbag I have is this baby blue handbag. And I guess that's as true as we're going to get. I love this blue. I will say it's pretty hard to pair um, because it's a difficult, it's a difficult blue to match. I'll just, I'll be honest. It's not like your typical baby blue. You can tell there's a lot of white under there but this is the blue and that's the interior of the blue i don't know when this bag was made i feel like this was the first batch of blues that came out it definitely was the first batch i've worn this bag non-stop and i know one of the things with vegan leather that you start to question is is it going to peel and thus far none of my bags that i've noticed have started peeling yet so yeah i just wanted to throw that in there as i'm sharing my handbag collection with you guys all right i have two more small handbags to share we have this beautiful bubblegum pink unfortunately she does not get as much use as she should um for some reason i'm i just had uh not a hard time because when I'm pairing things, it's really not that hard. I can always throw in whatever color I want to. I just didn't reach for her as often, even though I love, love how beautiful this pink is. I love that beautiful pink in the interior. Um, that contrast is very, very nice. But yeah, this is how the pink looks. Um, I feel like the pictures are pretty true to color. Like the pictures that you're gonna see on the Telfar website, the handbag that you receive is pretty true the true to color. I had a yellow one. Um, you're not gonna see it in this video because I actually got rid of that one. That yellow was so difficult for me. I don't know why. It was just it just didn't go with anything in my outfit, and I just never. And I didn't go with anything in my wardrobe, I'm sorry. And I just never reached for it. So I was like, no, there's no point in me having that handbag. Um, the next one is this burgundy one. If you've been on my channel for a while, if you've seen my Telfar unboxings, you know I love this one for multiple reasons. Um, I love the burgundy color. Definitely screams fall and winter, um, but I love the back of my bag. Um, so back here, it was custom done. As you can see, it says, believe in God. 
um at some point and i've said this before i did plan on having it put in the front of this bag but i never got to it however i just love this handbag guys love it um that's the last small one i wanted to share for some reason this one again i think this was the first batch as well um this bag it's just so actually i'm saying these first batches like i know they're the first batch i don't know but i got them a long time ago um i love how this handbag feels like compared to the other ones that i shared this bag feels so much better and i don't know what it is i think it's the vegan leather that they use was just different um i don't know i like this one the most next bag i'm going to share with you guys is my medium telfar shopping bag so this one um i like i use it usually like if i'm going to like a cafe or something and i want to bring my laptop because i'm going to be editing videos there's so much room in here I recommend this if you're looking for a Telfar handbag and like you pack a lot of things for college students, high school students, um, just somewhere that you're going to put a lot in here. My laptop obviously fits perfectly because there's so much room, but I just feel like sometimes I'm trying to put things in here because I don't like that flat Telfar look. Like some people don't put much in their Telfar handbags and I don't like that look so I try to fill it. In the meantime, what I've done and I've always worn it this way. I have a let me show you guys let me just take it out and show you I have this um, organizer in here I got this one from Amazon if you guys want ask me in the comment section down below or I'll probably just link it in the description I have this organizer which I really really like um, I love organizers in my tote bag but I have this organizer that fits perfectly in here the only thing is see if you like that flat look of your Telfar, once you put the organizer in there, it changes the shape of your bag. So it'll almost remain kind of puffy. So if you don't like that look, don't get this organizer. But if you do, the organizer is great because it organizes stuff and also it gives your, it gives your handbag some structure. Um, but yeah, I like this one. I love how thick the straps are on the medium shopping bag i love that the inside has a zip closure right here if you want to see a little more about this handbag you can check out my unboxing i have that a lot of more a lot more details shared on there and there's also a snap closure like the rest of the handbags but yeah this is my medium telfar then i have the infamous telfar in a collaboration this was when they first released it. I think he's had a couple uh, in Telfar collab. I, I, he's released it a couple times by now. He has boots. There are like, are there jackets? I feel like there are. There are so many things um, to this collab. So if you like how this looks, I would recommend that you get it. This is Sherling. Love it. Like I really like this bag so much. It's exactly like the other medium shopping bag that I shared just that it's the UGG collab so you're gonna get the shirling and the inside this is it um, I still have it um, stuffed in here just because this one I will say with the other one um, the other medium bag I said I like it more structured this bag I do like wearing more flat like this is exactly how I like to wear it I don't want it to look too big I just feel like that looks weird with this handbag so I like wearing it like this okay and my last Telfar handbag is the large handbag and guys this thing is massive massive when I first bought it I was like oh I'm gonna use it when I go on vacation honestly I've yet to use it on vacation the thing is huge you can fit a whole purse I'm exaggerating just a little but I do feel like you can almost fit an entire person in there like this is my head this is the bag this is my body this is the bag it's huge like it's huge if you can see the thing is massive like the bag is just so bad so big I have not purchased an organizer for this bag I don't think I will because again this originally the purpose of this bag was just for me to 
you know take it out on vacation or like as a travel bag so I'll just be throwing things in here in here so I don't really need an organizer for it but this is the only large handbag I have and it's because it's so big I do not plan on purchasing another large shopping bag like it's so huge I know I've said that a lot but I feel like I I almost feel like yes I bought it because I want to do something with it but then again it's so big that I feel like I'll I rarely will use it if that makes sense so I will not be purchasing another large shopping bag those are all of the Telfar handbags that I get that I have I do plan on purchasing more I have an order in I did the um what is it secure your bag and I purchased a few more Telfar handbags at this moment I will say for the shopping bags I think I'm done when I get my final order I think I'm done um I feel like I'm almost gonna outgrow this look this style of the Telfar handbag um if he comes out with different looks for his bags then I'll definitely purchase it I'm gonna keep my eye out on the brand to see what he does with his brand but after this last purchase i think i'm done um with the way with the shopping bag look i think i'm done with that i have so many at this point that even if he came out with other colors i would probably find a different handbag in that color um unless it's a very very nice color so let me do throw that in there so but if it's a very nice rare color i'll probably get it but for the most part i think i'm done if you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section down below. If you have any questions, also ask me in the comment section down below. Like, how has my bag held up? Which I'll let you know right now. It's done pretty well. Like, my bags have done pretty well. If you've checked me out on Instagram, then you pretty much know that I use my handbags. You'll see me styling them. I use them out all the time. It's easy. I throw my phone in there, my wallet, um, every my keys. It serves its purpose. If you were to ask me which size I would recommend, if you're someone who carries basics like myself, your phone, your keys, your wallet, smaller things, I would say just get the small Telfar shopping bag. If you're someone who wants to use the Telfar bags for school or you carry laptops or things like that, I would say get the medium. If you want it for travel, then get the large. But just know that the large is <laughs> insanely large. Like this bag is humongous. Humongous. Like you could probably, am I exaggerating? I was going to say you could probably fit a desktop in there. But like the thing is just it's huge there's like my monitor in the back i don't know how big it is i forget but this thing is so big do you see it compared to the monitor it's just it's insanely huge so if you plan on traveling with it great but it's just such a big bag it's almost overwhelmingly big but yeah any questions comments anything let just put it in the comment section down below remember to be kind to yourself and be kind to others love yourself and love others as well also remember to give this video a thumbs up guys thumbsing up my video liking my video gets my videos out there turn on your notifications so that you're notified of when i put out a new video of course subscribe if you're watching my videos and you're not subscribed yet please do subscribe but yeah see you in the next video